Hello, Georgia Burns here. Today I'd like to show you how I made this male birthday card using the stamp set Sailing Home. In it I've used the um, lighthouse and the birds, but I've also used the dies for the lighthouse and the steering, steering wheel, ship's wheel, which I've already cut out by the way. I'm also using Label Me Bold and the Happy Birthday one. Now for Mother's Day I received this. A Sizzix Psychic. It says Sizzix there and it's a Psychic. It's a baby big shot. And it's only a tiny one. And I'm going to use that to cut an oval out. The second largest straight oval. So I'm going to use that because you need an oval here. And I thought I would use my little machine to cut it out. It will cut out the lighthouse and the steering wheel as well. But I'd already cut them out when I made this card. So, to get started we'll need a card base of 11 and 3 quarters by 4 and 1 eighth. Scored at 5 and 7 eighths, folded in half and burnished which I'd already done and two pieces of oh, I've got three here two pieces of white cardstock one for the front and one for the inside what did I do inside oh, that's right I stamped a anchor which I never got out which I have out now and place that on there um, the only thing I never got out was my Night in Navy ink. Because it's all stamped in Night in Navy. Right. So, let's stamp. Now let's cut out our oval first. So I need a piece of a scrap guard. I'll just use this. Right. Now because the plates on my Sizzix sidekick, that's how big they are. Two and a half inches long, uh, wide. And five inches long. Obviously your card can only be two and a half inches wide. So I am going to chop a piece of card to put on there and put my oval on and it will just fit like that. Put the other glass plate on top like you would on a normal um, big shot. Place that in there and wind it round. Bring it back. Right. And there we have one oval. So this one is the second largest oval from the nesting dies. That will come in so handy for cutting little things out. A nice present off my daughters for Mother's Day. Yeah. Uh, what next? Oh, stamping. Yeah, let's do some stamping. Right, this is the front. Now I'm going to place that down there where I want it. As straight as I can. Like that. And then I'm going to get my birds. We're going to do them first. And actually, I'm going to stick a bit of this. Low tech tape 
just to keep it still. And I'm going to stamp my birds with one of the birds coming off. So I'm going to stamp that there. And then stamp that there. So that my birds, one bird is coming off the oval. That's all I wanted. Right. Can take that off. And put that to one side. We don't need that. We need our scrap. Is that big enough for that? Yeah. And stamp our lighthouse out. In fact, why don't I just cut out this one? I need to wash my cloth out. I'll cut that out in a minute. And we need a scrap of paper, or a scrap of card, should I say. I'm going to use this piece. Not big enough. And we're going to stamp this happy birthday just down the bottom there. Nice. And we'll cut that out. Then the inside, we're going to stamp the anchor. And we're just putting it on the right hand corner at the bottom. Like that. This is night and navy. It's the worst thing for me to play with. That and red. So get it all over me. Look, that's off the cloth. Alright, that's that. Now, if I get the sail house out, place that on there. With some low tack tape. I am going to have to trim this down. And And then we have our lighthouse. I do like my little sidekick. Bin. One thing about the um, cutting um, mats. You can actually buy replacements. Right, and there is our sign, sign, sentiment. So really all we've got to do now is put this card 
together. Oh, and you have to cut out a steering wheel out of, I've got very matted gold. It's a matte gold. Right, let's stick this on the inside. This piece on the outside. Sorry about that. That was daughter number three phoning. Do you know how dad was? Right. Stuck that on. Um, right now we need some uh, dimensionals. Finish these off, might as well. Put that down the middle. Just ripping these off any old way. <laughs> right, take backings off. Just got to line this up with our bird, with his wing. There we are. Right, the lighthouse, we're going to stick there. Don't want to put it on the bird. But we just need a bit of a dimensional in this corner. Just there. That's fine. So we'll take the backing off and we'll glue the rest of the lighthouse. All right, and with this ship's wheel, we'll Place some glue on it. And just pop that down there. All right, with the happy birthday, I'm going to pop it on top of the wheel. But I'm going to get two tiny mini dimensionals and put them one end, take off the paper, put some glue on the rest and stick that down like that and then I Gonna guess the rest. <laughs> oh, right. I've got some pearls that I've coloured in with Night and Navy blend pen, and pop them. Three of them on the card. Like so. And there we have it, a male birthday card. Hope you like it, if you do give us a thumbs up. If you'd like to see more of my cards please subscribe. Um, if you press the bell icon you'll be notified of any more videos I upload which is usually a Monday, Wednesday and Friday. All I can say is thanks for visiting and I hope to see you again soon.